David the Bug Eye Guy here with two beautiful leaf green cars. This is Cosmo, a 1960 Bug Eye, and here's Jean, another 1960 Bug Eye. What a luxury, two gorgeous leaf green. Oh, just a special sight. I don't know where else in America right now you can see two beautiful cars of this nature that are both the same color, both correct. One a 948, the other a 1275 car, just kind of special to have them both in our little museum, at least for today, until they go to a new home. But I want to show you on this video a little bit about bug eye tops. Now that we're in December and we have weather protection issues, of course, a hard top's a nice option, but it's not for everybody. We have these soft tops, and um, I wanted to show you a little about how to fold them. They are difficult to work with because there's this crossbar in the back. This bar here, which I've removed, is, I have one hand to do the video and the, the uh, description today, so I took it out ahead of time. This bar hooks on the back here on these little... They're under the towel protecting the deck that they hook on those little chrome fittings and lock down the back of the top. But if you leave the bar in, what happens is it's very difficult to get a good fold on the back section of the top where these quarter lights are. So by removing the bar, which goes in this pouch here, only takes a few seconds to slide it out, it allows you to crease the top along this edge where the quarter lights are and do minimal damage to the plastic windows. Of course, when these tops need replacing, it's usually because the plastic windows have gotten scratched. So taking care of the plastic windows is the best way to protect your top investment. And this is the way to fold them in the most compact footprint so that you can actually stow them in the boot by taking out that bar. If you leave the bar in, you end up with a much more cumbersome package. So now what to do with it? If you throw it into the boot, you'll scratch the window. As I discussed, that's not what you want. So we've designed this bug eye top tube. And what that does is it forms a pouch. And it's a little difficult for me to do with one hand. But inside this pouch, we have a nice soft flocked material. And we slide the, the uh, top in there. We take our bar, and I'll show you how we made a pouch for that as well. You slide the bar into this pouch. It's got its own snap. That I can do with one hand, but barely. And snap it closed. Open this up. Slide your top in. And now you have your own container, which if there were a top in it, it would be a better example. But again, we'll have to just imagine for the moment, since I'm one-handed. Now you can slide your top right into the boot of the car. Here's our side curtain wallet. That can go in there as well. Both pieces can slide right in over the spare tire. And now you still have your little parcel shelf to use. You've got your weather gear in the trunk, perfectly protected. And you can go off bombing around town without fear of damaging your investment. So that's the new side curtain wallet and top tube from BugEyeGuy.com.